Okay, when it comes to rating your comic book, there's no definitive way. I'm going to tell you two different methods I use, and you can choose whichever one uh, you're more comfortable with. Now, the first one is very detail-oriented. You're going to break the story down page for page, panel for panel. Each panel is going to contain the character's action, character's emotions, uh, important background detail, and the character's dialogue. When you're done, it's almost going to look like a movie screenplay. In fact, I actually use a screenwriting program called Final Draft to write my comic book scripts, but it's not uh, necessarily needed. It's just what I'm comfortable working in. Uh, any word program, word document is, is fine for writing your comic book scripts. Now, the other method is uh, less detailed. It's almost as if you're writing a short story. It's going to be uh, three to four paragraphs tops where you're just going to hit on the key points of action now, for Coney Waves, I found that my artist, Steve, he enjoys uh, having more freedom to tell this story. So I just give him the three to four paragraphs, and he breaks it down into 22 pages. Now, when you work with your, your artist, it's all going to depend on their comfort level as well as your comfort level of what type of story you want to hand to them. I'm sure working with a less experienced artist, they're going to want the panel for panel uh, description so they know what they're drawing. But like I said, it's all uh, personal preference. It's what whatever uh, you're more comfortable working in.